Hi everybody, I'm Kirsty Meeky and welcome to the Kirsty Meeky YouTube channel! Woo! Where today I shall be experimenting, pretending basically, that I'm going to change my career and become a dentist. <laughs> I've always thought that nails and dentistry are a very similar career. However, one is far better paid than the other. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I picked the wrong one. But uh, <laughs> let's have a go. You'll know what I mean when we get cracking. Come on, let's get cracking with the knacking, as Adam would say. <laughs> So you might have noticed um, I have better teeth than I had before. <laughs> Let's just say did, that. You got, did you get them free with the channel? <laughs> so I've, I've, um, I've always had, I, oh, I've always wanted to have a wider smile because I've got a really narrow mouth and my teeth were never really amazing. And I wanted them to be amazing. And whenever I've been a dentist and I've seen him do stuff, I always thought, oh, I think I could do that. So let me tell you a story. My late auntie Lynn, um, she used to have a false tooth that, she did nails as well, um, but she had this false tooth that she made herself out of acrylic. And she used to, you know the stuff that you put dentures in with? Mm -hmm. she, used to, she used to put it in with that. <laughs> yeah. And it worked. <laughs> Not recommending it, just saying. Haley's grand gets her teeth out for Isaac to take them out. He's so freaked out by it, <laughs> but he loves it at the same time. But it like horrifies him. Because he's like, <laughs> oh, me mate Donna. Donna's got um, the front tooth here is on a plate, and she regularly flips that out and goes, goes like, <laughs> like this, but it does this horrible face. It's funny, dead funny. And it's quite scary as well. Bit like Hannibal Lecter. So I went to Kiss Dental. Every time I think about my teeth, I talk funny. <laughs> I'm still getting used to them. Um, I went, how long ago? A week? Yeah. So yeah, about a week ago, and um, I've had composite veneers. And the reason I had composite veneers was because um, there was less prep of your teeth involved. When you have porcelain veneers, yes, they last longer, but do you have to file your teeth? Not a lot, but do you have to file them? Not like you see them little pegs. That's like, you know, that's, you shouldn't be doing that. So I've been told anyway, I'm not a dentist, but today I'm going to be a dentist because I have something to show you. Not just my teeth, but let's have a look in here. This might gross people out a little bit. I'm feeling quite vulnerable showing you this, to be honest, because it just shows the sheer state of my old teeth. And I'm actually having the bottoms ironed and done as well. I'm having them done so they all look match and they look nice. So this is, these are my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> it's like an alien mouth, you know, from the movie Alien. Oh my god. It's like the little one that comes out of the big one's mouth. Oh my god. <laughs> so, um, Dr. K made me these, so he's casted them in stone because I had this idea. And obviously, it's a bit strange, but you know, that's me. Um, and you can actually see my missing teeth as well. So, this one, this one, um, I had to have taken out when I was pregnant with. Um, Alicia, and this one I had to take. I've, I've taken out when I was pregnant with Cassidy, so my, my teeth, my teeth just fell apart while I was pregnant. They just, the children, they just took everything from me. <laughs> this one, um, I had to have taken out because it was a little bit, yeah, it was done. Sweets, yeah. So I've had the top eight done and I'll be having the bottom eight done because they are the only visible teeth that you actually see. Yeah, so nobody sees these what missing so ones. So you still got skanky teeth in the back then? Yeah. 
Park. <laughs> but eventually, I will have them implant post things put in. Oh. But not yet, not yet. Like, I've got to save. I've got to save up for have these dashes done. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> got to start saving again. So the more views we get, I'll have more teeth. <laughs> Views mean teeth? Yeah, views mean teeth. So, I really wanted to have a go myself. And because me and Dr. K were talking, we were saying how similar the skill set is to create teeth, to make teeth out of, whether it's porcelain or, you know, composite veneers, um, to build teeth. It's so similar to doing nails. And I'm sure the nail technicians out there that feel the same. And I always think that, so you've got your nails and your skin around your nail is very much like the gum and then the nail is the tooth, yeah? And I do think they are very similar. Yes, I know you wipe your bum with one of them and you don't wipe your bum with the ones in your mouth. But you get what I mean, you get what I mean. I'm just gonna pop some gloves on because I've got one hand done and one hand not and I definitely don't want to mess this hand up. This hand I don't care so much about. Well, I care about the hand, just not the yeah. nail so much. Um, and we're going to pretend we're in a dentist and they, you know, they always wear rubber gloves, don't they? Open wide! <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a different kind of place. Um, <laughs> you don't want teeth down, no. <laughs> so, I'm, I'm feeling a bit nervous because I don't really know how this is going to work. So I'm confused as to what you're even going to do. Right, so I'm, I'm going to concentrate on the top set because obviously I've only got my top set done. Um, and I am going to attempt to make teeth on these that look like the teeth that are in my mouth. Right, so when you have your impressions done, you can see like there's some little imperfections from where the um, the, the alginate, is that the right word? Where the alginate goes a bit funny. So I'm just going to trim this and just make this, kind of prep it like it, it was a cuticle. Do you know what I mean? Are you taking away the non-living tissue and stuff? So that's... Are you going to use your e-files? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Of course, dentists use these kind of things too, you know. I'm going to use the um, secret weapon bit. I think that's going to be my favoured, favoured bit for this treatment today, darling. Could you open wide, keep it wide, please. Do you know how long it took, took to do these teeth? Three hours. Um, quicker than you do nails. <laughs> Nails. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna start by. I hope this works because who knows? Oh god, it does. Yeah. So if we take off this, and because we want this nice border, don't we? You know, like with a nail, you want to get all that a nice equal border. This is going to go terribly wrong. I can just see it now. Just saying. Oh no, it's all right. I don't know, I just hope it just works. So I didn't have any injections when I had my teeth done. Um, I've got a friend who had porcelain veneers. She actually had 14 injections, but they have to do a lot of prep work. And I suppose every person is different. And she had to have a lot of prep work. So every tooth that she basically had done, she had to have an injection because they had to prep like this so they had to like file down the teeth i didn't have to have any of that done which i was quite surprised i kind of like worked myself up to having all these injections if you're new to this channel i am not a dentist i am a nail technician <laughs> But I like to do things that are a little bit different. A bit fun. Right, so I kind of want to smooth this because I think this is going to help me with the application of the product. 
And I was toying between, oh, do we use, you know, acrylic gel or do we use acrylic? And I thought, you know what? Well, I might as well go go ham on the products and use acrylic because it's so goddamn white. Um, so I thought, we'll use acrylic. When I have my bottom ones done, he said that I'll have to have an injection for one of the tooth because one of the teeth because one of them is like really wonky basically. <laughs> so he needs to he needs to file that. He did say to me, "Do you want do you want to look like um, you've had them done, or do you want them to look natural?" And did he see your lips? <laughs> I was like, hmm. I kind of want them to look like Madame Dawn. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, yeah, I thought that would be the answer. As you said before, you're not so natural. I'm not, no. I just freedom of expression in, in lots of different forms. So I haven't got the, the sucking machine that sucks all the, the, the stuff away. I have got a dust extractor. You hate the, the hoover. The, the water and the hoover. Yeah. That, I think that's probably the most uncomfortable thing. Apart from obviously if you're having a root canal, root canal filling thing and all that, 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 you know, a little bit painful. But yeah, the sucky water thing. Yeah. Um, I'm going to swap bits. I'm going to use my cuticle bit just so I can get a little bit like in a bit closer like look at that looks weird look at that that ring yeah. why is it like wrinkly like that you've got wrinkles so old <laughs> even in your mouth's wrinkly <laughs> got a bit of botox in there right so this little bit we'll just cut in a little bit tighter I had a bad experience with a dentist once. Really? Yeah, I had a, I needed a filling. So they said, I don't always believe them. But anyway, <laughs> I needed a filling here where I've got the electric file now. Mm. They filed away my teeth that much mm. and filled it. I looked like Madonna. It's not a bad thing with the line on it, but I'm just trying to say I had a massive gap in between my teeth. Oh, really? Yeah, they left this big, massive gap in between my teeth. And because I, I was like, felt it like that. And I was like, what's that? And then they give me the mirror, and I just burst into tears. I was like, what the fuck are they to me? They were like, oh, you'll get used to it. I was like, get used to it. I, yeah, I didn't look like that before. Have you done that to me before? So I, um, they, so they filled it in and then I just thought, why did they do that? Something like the gap in the teeth or don't I think it really suits some people. It, it like looks so nice. There's some real top models that have the gap and it looks amazing. But me, I, I, I was like, and it was because I think, well, that wasn't what I was like, asking him to do. I was asking him to kind of just sort my teeth out. Right, let's have a look. Right, okay, so we're gonna build on top. And, I'll, and if, I wanna explain what he's done to mine because um, if you look back on old videos, maybe don't, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> um, you can only really see like four of my teeth because I'd smile. And I haven't really got a wide smile I have now, but. Um, you'd only really see sort of four and a half teeth, four, five teeth at the most. Um, so what he's done is, so see this high arch, this high arch here. What he's actually done is built them out so they come wider. So my smile is wider, so you see more teeth. I need, well, I'd love to be Julia Roberts, Doc. I would, but yeah. So I'm gonna sort of go with that and 
fear I can do it. You never know, Doc. You might find me at Kiss Dental doing everybody's gnashes. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to use white. It's going to be really white. It's going to be proper Simon Cowell going on. Um, so, I'm going to use the Genesis Nail Comey acrylic. So, this is the Primalist Monomer. I would not suggest you doing this on somebody's teeth. That is like a massive disclaimer. Seriously, do not put acrylic on your own teeth, okay? Could you do somebody's false teeth, though? Get them, take them out, give them a good wash, and then just tart them up a bit. I don't know. I think I probably could. But yeah. If you're really good at it, maybe. A bit of blame. Oh, I don't know. I'm saying I think I could. I haven't even done it before, so I, I might ruin somebody's dentures. <laughs> Thing is, it's different. They were different. It's a different process. They used polishing, polishing bits and everything like that. Whereas we won't do that today. We do a different technique. So yeah, I wouldn't be messing with anybody's teeth. Please don't. Please don't sue me because you've followed this tutorial and, and done your own teeth. <laughs> Christ Almighty, we'll be in trouble. Right. So let's see what see what we can do here. So I'm going to start with the middle ones because that's what he did. I don't want this to run anywhere, so I'm going to bleed the back of my brush out. Let's... Oh my god. One thing I don't understand is how did he get it so like neat at the I was going to say cuticle area? <laughs> how did he get it so neat at the gum? At the gum line. Like that's it, that's... So, hang on, are they not like made and then fitted? No. Did they do this on the end? Um, not, they, they think they start with like a little cap, I think it's a cap at first. Right. And then they build it with the composite. Okay. And it cure, they cure it with a LED light. So a little tiny light goes into your mouth. And these are longer, so my teeth, that I've got in my head right now are a little bit longer. Like that, okay? Yeah, it kind of comes down just below your lip now. Yeah. Uh, they never used to. You never saw my teeth before. They were just a bit non-existent. And that's, I wanted to have teeth showing because I think they look nice. And you guys may have a completely different opinion. You may look and go, those teeth are awful, Kirsty. Why have you had those teeth? But they're in my head, so let me be. I'm just gonna add a little bit here. So we put me one on, on the, he did the one, yeah, and then, he sat me up and I was like, what's up, Dad? <laughs> I felt like some bunny rabbit. I was like, oh my God, he hadn't filed it or anything. And it was- I believe he made the mistake of showing you something before it was finished. I think he started critiquing it immediately. Well, I was like, uh, yeah, I was <laughs> a little bit like that. Yeah, I can imagine. He does training courses as well. You're really thinking about this, aren't you? I just think, you know, I don't know. If it all goes wrong in, the, in life, then yeah. you get people's teeth, is that what you're saying? Yeah. It's like me, if it all goes wrong in life, I can do nails. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad though. No, I'm, I'm not saying that people do nails. Do nails, everything's gone wrong. Just if my film career doesn't take off like I think it would. That would be really sad. Now they do look a bit like um, Oaks Bunny or something. <laughs> <laughs> they look ridiculous. They look ridiculous. Yeah, they don't quite look like you. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. They're not quite as flat. They're a bit round. They're a bit round. I've got to file them yet, all right. Oh, you're going to file them? Yeah, of course oh. I'm gonna file them. Right. Like with it with an e-file. E yeah, yeah. yeah. Unless you want an e-file. 
And I know we did say that my teeth flare, like my original teeth flare out. So they'd like narrow at the top but flare out at the bottom. So we've got to change that. I'm trying to change that a bit as well. Okay. Do we do we look kind of some Okay, now you need a lot of brush control to do this, I'm just saying. Let me just let them set a little bit. Let's do this one here because, so I'm going in one, two, three, bouncing like that, draining off any liquid out my brush because I know when I place this bead down, I don't want it to run into the gum line. <laughs> <laughs> But you know where nails came from, don't you? It was a dentist who fixed his nail. Yeah, well, have, yeah but nails have been getting done for like millennia. Oh, no, no, yeah, this is what I mean. It was right. like, um, a, oh, right, yeah. Like the Egyptians yeah, the used to Egyptians, do, yeah. They used to do fake nails. But I think I don't know what they made them out of. maybe it's the acrylic nails yeah, and the, stuff. Yeah. So I'm led to believe, you know, I've been told. Because it's a plastic. Yeah, well, it's still a polymer and a monomer. It's still, yeah. you know, it's a plastic-based yeah, product. Yeah, and plastics weren't really discovered until sort of the 19th century. Oh, yeah, yeah I know that. So they used to use other things for teeth. What did they use for teeth, then? Dead people's teeth. What? So the dentists used to use teeth from dead people to replace... No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Oh. oh, that is gross. That's. I'm sorry. I won't be donating my teeth to anybody when I when I die. <laughs> I think I've nice ones, haven't I? <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean with yours? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm not going to donate my teeth when I die. I want them well and truly in my head. I didn't know that. Yeah. Dead people's teeth. That. You don't need them. Yeah, I know, but it's just, why would you want a dead person's, like, tooth in your mouth? Eat without it. Well, I, 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 you know what? Yeah, I get it. But, do they, like, have a right good clean on it? Then they'll use porcelain as well, won't they? I, mean, I wonder if they use bone, like ivory and stuff. Hmm. You might be right. Now, are there any dental nurses watching this? I would love to know your opinion on my lack of skill. <laughs> I was kind of worried about flossing my teeth and I thought, oh, will I be able to floss my teeth still? But I can and it's like, everything still works. <laughs> I think you've got to be really quite creative and have like a really good eye for detail when you, you do this for a job. Yeah, I agree. So did he file yours down then? No. Yeah. He fi no, he filed them like after, kind of buffed them and stuff. Mm. That's what you mean. I thought you meant, yeah. did he like, he trimmed my fangs a little bit? No, I just mean like, what you, like, because so, obviously you're creating this now, but like he created it like that and then filed them. Yes. Yeah. Into, work. Into not a big white blob like that. Yeah, exactly. Is that what you're trying to say? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, in the nicest possible way. Aren't those ones supposed to be thicker? <gasps> yes, they are. So that is straight. You are right. Because there were times where he said, oh, I need to add a bit more there. He kept sitting me up checking. 
Right, no, nope, needs a bit more there. Yeah, because we need to come out, don't we? We need to bring the smile out. So maybe I just need a little bit more on the other one as well, you know. Look how, look how diddy that tooth is. That is tiny. How has he managed to do that tooth? That looks like a really tricky one. Especially when he's had to build it up so much as well. I mean, I didn't even know you could widen your smile. I thought you would just, well, you know, you just add them on top of your tooth and add them straighter and wider. I didn't know you could make them wider. And I was like, oh, it sounds good. So I think I still need to come out a little bit here with this little tiny baby tooth here. I'll tell you what, they're nice and white, these teeth are, aren't they? <laughs> and do you know when you have your nails done and you can feel the jowl heating up and you feel that warmth on your nail? That's very good. Well, anyway, that's <laughs> what you feel. I could feel it on the tooth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could feel that it warming slightly. I wish I could have had like, watched like a, him doing everything he was doing at the same time. Is that what, you know what I mean? Like a video. Yeah, while he's doing. Like a little video, like a little camera on yeah. whatever he's using. Yeah. Right, so can you see how we've brought this out here? You see how the smile comes wider mm -hmm. and it tucks in on this side and you see how we've gone a bit thicker. Obviously I'm going to file. I'm going to pile them a bit because they're a bit big then, Doc. Mm. Yeah, so let me... Oh, that was too wet. Look, I've gone in between. That was too wet. Never going to be able to floss that. I need a bit of work then. I need a bit of filing. Right, let's have a look. Right, I'm going to try my pink bit first because it's a little bit more gentle. Then if it's not enough, I'll, I'll go down and get, I'll, I'll use the purple one which is a bit coarser. Yeah. Right, so I'm going to use my dust collector. Um, this one's from Nail Come Now, I suppose with nails, you have to get them both like all the same length, like equal and balanced. But they're not sat right next to each other. <laughs> God, it, you know what? I've, I'm holding this in my hands and it's difficult enough. <laughs> Imagine when he's, it's in somebody's mouth. Yeah. Do you know what I feel like I need to do? <laughs> I feel like I just need to hold it on a file. <laughs> and then they'll all be straight then, won't they? didn't. <laughs> no, they're supposed to be big like that. No, but like, Don't forget, you can't see all that bit. It's a bit <laughs> so no, I'm going to use, I'm not going to use a harsher bit, I'm going to be fine. Because they do, they kind of come out 
they come out and down a bit like when you look at the side of it, it's a little bit like a nail like an apex do you know what i mean so you've got like this apex here and then it goes flatty it's that kind of thing because i know because i'm a dentist because i know what i'm talking about honest right so i'm going to just neaten up that gum line or cuticle area can you imagine me being like one of those really gentle dentists as well because mm. i'm dead gentle sure. gentle kirsty you call me so do you know how they put that sandpaper between your teeth and file between so you've got a gap so you can floss and that is that how they do it, is it? i think it, it feels like it's sandpaper anyway <laughs> I'm going to try if I can get with, well, yeah, with the nail paper off. If I can get it off. Just destroying one of our files. Yeah, they're not flossing these bad boys. I don't know, a little bit. It's working a little bit. So ladies and gentlemen, this is how you destroy a nail file. Hey, hey up, oh, we're cooking on gas. Well, I kind of need somebody to hold that so I can do both hands. Hey, oh, look at that. We can go in between. I don't think I'm doing too bad. <laughs> right, I'm going to buff them now. Right, so the only thing we can't really do is... Oh, no, my nail. Um, it does this kind of polishing thing with a polisher bit. Um... So I'm just going to soften them. And it also adds like texture to the teeth to make them look real. Um, I've tried to leave a little bit of kind of imperfection so it looks textured. Obviously that was all purpose. <laughs> soften those edges a little bit because I just think I've probably left that a little bit wide here. That little tiny bit there. Right, get food stuck in that. Definitely. Bit of bacon hanging out. Mmm, I don't think I'll get the job. I think he'll say, there's no job here for you. Stick to the nails. They're not too bad for somebody who's never done it before. But yeah, so he polishes them. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put top coat on them, Doc, to make them all shiny. <laughs> <laughs> what else would you put on? Right, so let's gloss them up. Now, don't flood the... The gum area. I actually think they look quite good. <laughs> I am actually quite impressed. Hey, charge a lot of money for this, you know. I am definitely in the wrong job. Somebody said to me, are they clippings in here? I said, what? Do they even do that? <laughs> yeah. 
clipping than he is. No, thank you. Look, we'll go for the real McCoy. Right, let's get them in the lamp. I'm going to turn them this way now, this way round, because I turned them upside down because the, um, well, because the, that bit there was stuck to the bottom of the lamp and I don't want it to stick to the bottom of the lamp. So um, I cured that bit and now we're in and we're, we're cooking. Let's see what happens. Now, how long's that taking me to? Um, about an hour, an hour and a bit. See, I'm quicker than my dentist. <laughs> Quicker than you, Dr. K. <laughs> See? And his job. No. Do you know what I couldn't do? It. I couldn't... Um, I couldn't be in other people's mouths. That's what I mean, yeah, like... Yeah, yeah. It takes a very special person to be doing that, like... Making dentures and things like that, but in the mouth. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, bad breath and... Yeah. And rotten teeth and... No, not for me, like... I'll stick to nails. Oh my god, look at them. <laughs> I think they're quite good. I know they're not perfect. I mean, do they look anything? They're brilliant white. Oh, they're brilliant. Oh, they're very white, aren't they? They're like way whiter than yours is. All right. I don't know whether it's just the light, you know, that's yeah. bouncing off them, is it? They're not bad. They look better than my granddad's dentures, they do. <laughs> You'll have to do the rest, like, do the gum line thing, change it one day. Yeah. And then do the bottom part yeah. as well. See who's got the better teeth. Who's got the best teeth? Well, it's definitely fair to you. <laughs> I think for the beginning, not bad. Please comment below whether you think I should give up doing nails and be a dentist. Mm. So there we are, we had a bit of fun. So we, we, maybe I shall just, in my own time, have a go at doing the bottom. I mean, look at the difference. Bad, isn't it? Look how bad. So this one at the bottom here, this one that jumps out, that's the one he's got file. He's got, so we'll file that back and build it up so they become straight. God, they're of that sight, aren't they? Oh. <gasps> So if you want to know where all the products are that I've used today, Jock, they're all nail products, they're not dental products, uh, they'll be listed below. Um, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Instagram and all that shebang. Like, share, comment and all the things that I want you to do, please. Thank you very much. If you've made it to the end of this video, thank you. And I hope you weren't bored out of your brains watching me make teeth on teeth, <laughs> on my old teeth. Yeah, it's very strange. Welcome to the Strange Channel. Um, but yeah, thank you. Um, thank you for joining us. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Ta-da, duck! Welcome back to my channel.